What's up, you guys? Uh, this is another custom hide that I made, and it's for the Leopard Gecko Fry and Leopard Gecko Expert contest prize. And um, so Rudy's gonna be paying me, and here is um, the winner. It's Poppy Scooper or Poopy Scooper, whatever it is. Um, everyone, go subscribe to him. Uh, he has lots of tegus and leopard geckos and lots and lots of other stuff. Crested geckos, like tons of stuff. Um, so go subscribe to him. And the best part, the hide. Yes, it looks awesome. I know it does. You don't have to tell me. Um... But yeah, here it is. I still have a few little hot glue things that I'll be picking off all night. Um, because I had to hot glue the plants in. Uh, so I'll pick all those off before I ship it to you. Um, but I just wanted to make the video to show you. Um, but here it is. It is made out of insulation foam that I carved into this shape. And just really did a lot of stuff um, so just to kinda get a better view I have this little kinda boulder thing that I made and a fake plant and then just some walls another fake plant um, just kind of a wall and then up here I have another fake plant and big little boulder thing just to make it not flat. Um, little hole for it to crawl down into. And the leopard gecko will be able to crawl up the sides. It has a really good texture for that. Um, so don't worry about it not being able to crawl up. Because my leopard geckos, they will crawl up that all the way to the top. And then just crawl back down just for fun. So... Trust me, it will be able to crawl even if it is pregnant. Um, so he wanted me to make this kind of an egg laying box for his leopard geckos. Um, so this will be going in the corner of his 20 gallon. And uh, so pretty much you can see inside of there, you can see it laying the eggs, you can see it doing whatever. And if you need to get the eggs out, because this is kind of a tight squeeze, I made this so you can take it off, and it has kind of puzzle pieces to keep it in place. And um, I have a little ramp there, and the ramp is made out of floral foam because it has a really nice texture to it, and also has really good traction. And so I have that hot glued in and have painted over the hot glue and same down here and um, tell me if you want me to put any plexiglass in here um, like kind of on the bottom if you want to put peat moss or something in there for egg laying um, but yeah it's pretty sturdy it looks really nice has some cool areas to hide in and I wish I could keep it <laughs> I'll probably just make one for myself but yeah this is yours yours um, so yeah everything fits together and to keep this from moving around I have it all like figured out with all the measuring and all that stuff with the little extra pieces so, it just kind of stays on top pretty much. And, yeah, so your leopard gecko will love it. Love it, love, love it. And I hope you love it. So, yeah, just send me a PM if you want anything else done to it. Um, it does have a better paint job in person than on the camera. Uh... It, the camera just doesn't really pick up stuff. But yeah, I hope you like it. Tell me if you want me to add any more plants, because I have plenty of plants. 
everywhere, lots and lots of plants. Um, so yeah, tell me what you think, and um, just, yeah, I guess you know the drill. Uh, yeah, hope you like it.